How could you? What? He was a good man. A good man. What the hell are you talking about? That thing tried to kill me. It's not a man, it's a monster. No. No, that's not how it was supposed to go. That's not what I agreed to. Murphy? Is that you? Officer Coleridge? Jeez, I'm glad it's just you. This thing is kicking off something fierce. I knew you'd be smart enough to steer clear of it. What are you doing here? Sewell told me to meet him here. You haven't seen him, have you? He ain't answering his radio. Are you okay, Murph? You don't look so good. What's that you got there? What the hell's going on, Murphy? No. This isn't what I agreed to. What are you talking about? Ag agreed to what? Tell him, Murph. What's going on here, Sewell? Why didn't you answer the radio? Should have learned to keep your big fucking mouth shut, Frank. Now my friend Murphy's got to shut it for you. Murphy, don't, don't do this. Come on, Murphy, you gonna keep your end of the bargain or not? <laughs> do it, you Murphy. son of a bitch! No. No. You know, he was a great man, my dad. Didn't matter who you were, family, friends, even prisoners. He treated everyone with respect. Always looking for the positive side of people. I wanted to be just like him. <laughs> You don't understand. Your father treated me like one of his own. I never... He didn't die right away, you know. After you were done beating the life out of him, he spent years in that wheelchair. A... a fucking vegetable. Did you know that? And I had to watch this... this wonderful man shit and piss all over himself day after day after day. And every time I looked at him, you know what I saw? Listen to me. I, I saw a monster. I saw you. Just calm down a minute and let me tell you what really happened. You don't know how many strings I had to pull to get your transfer approved, to get you to my prison. The favors I had to call in, the sick things I had to do to get you under my watch. You don't have to do this. My father was a good man. He didn't believe in revenge, but I do.
No. I won't do it. Yeah, I thought you might say that. <laughs> no! Jesus, you're pathetic. What about Napier? The guy kills your boy. You go through all the trouble of getting yourself locked up with him, and what happens? I serve him to you like a fucking Christmas goose, and you can't even finish the job. No, I gotta go in there and finish the bastard off for you. I ask for one little favor in return. Murphy, run! And this is the facts I get! Oh, Frank! Put your hands where I can see them. You son of a... I'm not gonna tell you again. Sewell here, we got an officer down. 10 double zero, C block, shower level, over. You can't do this. I didn't. Whose prints do you think are on that shiv? 10-4, backup's on its way, sit tight. Roger that. Should've just kept your end of the deal, Murph. Cop killers don't last too long in here. I'm sorry, Frank. I'm sorry, Frank. It wasn't you. It was my fault he died. Pendleton. I'm so sorry. I forgive you. Yeah. I think we are. All units respond. Wyo Prison DOC bus involved in the TC. Fatalities eastbound 73. Fire and rescue en route. I should go. I guess you better. Wait. Where are you going? There's some place I gotta be. Wait. Thank you. For what? The truth. back here so soon, sweetheart. Can't get enough of the place. <laughs> the hell's this? You used to work with my father, Frank Coleridge. Yeah? So? We need to talk. Revenge is a long, treacherous road, isn't it, Mr. Pendleton? Where do you suppose it ends?